And I believe that we are live on twitch.tv slash Asuma. We got bananas in chat from Monkey Ben, Satanistic Angel, Billman68, and Brain1432. Overpowered spoon of a banana, and now the bananas are off the screen, which means we've got a lot of excited peeps tuning in today. Throwing their bananas in chat. I appreciate all of you tuning up, uh, tuning up, turning up, tuning in. See, they're combined together. For Mushroom Wars, a little bit of nostalgia, a one-off stream. Maybe maybe there'll be more than one, but uh, this is a game I played not so long ago on the PlayStation, on the PlayStation Network, I believe when I had the PS3. The PlayStation 3 was the last time I did, like, you know, proper gaming. When I was a kid, I played a lot of games. As I got a bit older, I played them a bit less, and the PlayStation 3 was the last time I proper you know, played a bunch of games, and this was one of them. Um, Aphelion is here for 58 months in a row. Goodness me, getting close to that evil X face in chat. Aphelion there saying bananas. Thank you ever so much, dude. I appreciate it, and I hope you uh, enjoy the stream. Pre-stream music was Sabaton with, uh, was it Rise of the Dead Men or something of the Dead Men? The Dead March again? They, uh, they put out a video on the Sabaton History Channel. Now, if you're a fan of Sabaton, a fan of metal or military history, or you like Indian Idol or the Great War channel, um, you've got to go check out the Sabaton channel. And as soon as that came on, and I was like, I love this song off of the record, and I want to know what it's about. And uh, it is about a, a, a battle around a fort that the Germans were trying to take, and they used mustard gas, or the equivalent of some form of gas. And the story goes that the soldiers that they gassed came out of their trenches and they looked like zombies because they were, you know, gas was absolutely disgusting in war. And they fought back and took over the fort as zombies. And so it's like this legendary story of, uh, you know, zombies taking back the fort. Um, and that's what the song's about. And the video went into the history of it. It was really fascinating. So that was in my head after watching it today. And uh, that's why it's the pre-stream music. We got Tom Two Toes Whitey. Here for five months saying, what server does host Hermitcraft and where has Hermitcraft vids gone? Dude, head over to my Asuma Says channel. There is a video there explaining that I am on a break of forms, which is why I'm not uploading Hermitcraft at the moment. And uh, also we host it on OVH, which I would actually not recommend given my uh, previous experience with them, but it's the company we chose to go with as a group. Mm, and that is some hot vegetable stock that I'm drinking right there. BG Monster X1 fan gifting a sub to Lemon Kiwi X. Lemon, thank you so much for the fan art. BG Monster, thanks for gifting the sub and supporting someone here in the community. I appreciate you doing that. Very kind of you to do so. And uh, yeah, thank you ever so much. Morbrick77 is here for 10 months, saying already 10 months, the time flies. It does, and it's going to fly today. Today will be a shorter stream just because I'm short on time, but we're going to play. Mushroom Wars, and I need y'all to help me. I haven't had time to set up the audio. I am going to turn up the volume once I figure out where to do that. Okay, here's where I do it. Now, that is a good volume for my ears. Let me know if it's too loud for you. So, as you'll see, there is a game called Mushroom Wars 2. I've never played it. I read really bad reviews. Apparently, it's not well supported on Steam, so we're doing the classic. And I played a couple of games for fun. I won both of them. Let's do the uh, campaign. I remember this. I remember this place. And I'll, I guess I'll be teaching you a little bit about the game as we play. Uh, let's try and do these on normal. I tend to play games on easy. I just like to have fun. Um, but since I've completed this game before, let's play it on normal. So you will see what we got to do in just a moment. Too quiet, says Cubs Cola. It, yeah, based on how my audio is set up, I can totally understand if you think it's too quiet. Let's try... Let's try that that loudness. So, yeah, it's a little bit louder now. Okay, and we've got a little graphical intro here. Man, you can see you can see they really went out all out on the budget here. Look at this CGI. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness me. It must have made took a millions to create that scene. <laughs> I think I might be uh, might be pushing it a bit there. Fat Scrap is here. Subscribe with Amazon Prime. Fat Scrap with a K. Thank you ever so much for uh, the Prime subscription. It is appreciated. I feel like they're trying to tell us a story, but I'm just not paying attention at the moment. What's going on here? Yeah, they're telling a story, and I'm just looking at my chat. What about the Minecraft streaming, says Zippo? Not today. Doing something a little bit different today. 
Okay, to capture the enemy's building, send your troops there with the right mouse button. What it will do is it will send half the troops in the building. We can observe this by going over there and you'll see that the amount has been halved, but we're also going to generate... Hey, the music just got really loud, didn't it? And I think my computer is... Aha, it's going to let me change it, so bear with me. Let's open the volume mixer. Yeah, going to drop that down to about there. That's That should be good. You can travel between your buildings using the left mouse button. That is something I didn't figure out when I was playing. Okay, so you can upgrade your buildings. So if I go there, right, I'm just selecting. Or is there like a, now I can select two. Oh wow, I'm learning. So I didn't know any of this before. I think you double click to upgrade and it costs some of your troops. So we've upgraded both of those. Oh, wow, I should have done this before. Right, so... Yep, we learned that a second ago. Ah, look, there's a little icon around Sweet. So I can send, like, a very small amount that way. Or I can send pretty much everything. I'm going to keep it in the middle. And maybe change it a little bit as we go. So, as you can see, it's like a one-for-one -one exchange. And now we have taken over those buildings. Uh, by just simply outnumbering them. Puzzle Frex says... Have you played this on the channel before? I feel like I've seen you play this. I don't believe so. I don't believe I've ever shown playing this game before. Might have played something a little bit similar. The concept has been done quite a few times. So uh, we'll start off by upgrading all of these buildings. And as you can see, we kind of need to send everything there to defend it. Uh, and possibly in need of a counter-attack, which we've just about survived. So that was a poor start. I think I'm going to upgrade that so we generate a little faster. I believe that's what upgrading does. And uh, we'll probably either wait for Blue to make a move or wait for this to fill up. You can see the amount of units we've got in total at the bottom. I'm going to upgrade both of those, which is a little bit risky. I'm going to send uh, a portion of units over there just to beef it up. As this one is getting full up. It's actually pretty even here, look. So, okay, so we're letting, we're letting Blue do a move. We're going to send... Uh, two lots over there. Oh my goodness me, we need to counter-attack. Like, get in there and defend. Yeah, just about held it. Just about. Now we're going to have a load of troops here. And I'm going to upgrade it. When you lose the building, though, it goes it goes down, doesn't it? And uh, let's send a portion of troops back out because we're not generating any. And that'll mean that we'll probably need to move some troops from here. Yeah, let's just get them walking over there and then upgrade that one. Okay, so we're in a really strong position now. We just need to kind of take our time and figure out what our move is. I think I know what we're going to do. We're just going to send everything here and we'll probably see Blue react. Now, Blue's only sent out a handful of units. Let's send a little bit more reinforcement there. Surely we're going to take that. Oh, nice. Then let's upgrade it and send a small amount of troops over to that one to try and keep it even. Right, you can see the fate of this game now, right? <laughs> Altis Pypho says, I love this game already. It's one of those sorts of games. You can probably tell if you love it or not pretty quickly, right? And now, who's going to win? I think I'm going to win, peeps. They're not even sending their troops out for a counterattack. And uh, that means it's ours. We've taken it. This reminded me of those Haunted games you play on aeroplanes, but Cutter, says Ravio. I don't know what on earth that is. Okay, um, we're going to send out for that pretty much straight away and upgrade both of these. So we take the one that's smaller first. And we might need to be a little bit more active this time around as there's more moving parts on the playfield, right? But we're going to use this one as probably a stop-off point for our next attack. Let's upgrade... Let's try and generate faster than our enemy. Okay, I think I'm going to upgrade our main base as well. And we're still doing better. And I think I'm going to upgrade both of these. See, I don't know whether it's worth upgrading or, or capturing. But we'll see what Blue does. Now, Blue might be sending them all the way over there. But it's not. Okay, that's fine. Let's upgrade that. We're kind of waiting. Okay, here's, here's where we're going to try and make a move, right? We're going to try and do the old counter-attack. So, we're going to keep its numbers low. 
And then I'm going to send some reinforcements back this way. Will we take it? Yes, we've got it. And room for an upgrade. Terrific. Um, send some troops back that way so you can keep generating. And now what we want to do is pretty much take over the one in the middle. But we could try something a little different, actually. I'm going to send a lot of troops over here. And we're actually going to try and attack them directly. Let's move some troops over there. In fact, we've got so much generating back here. It's probably better to send them to our forward positions. And now let's get out an absolute load of them. And a load again. And we're going to take this one here. Come on. We're, we Surely we got that. Yes. Beautiful. Upgrade. Upgrade. We are dominating over here. We are dominating. We might not even need to take the one in the middle. But I'd say given the current situation. Okay. I see what's going on here. We need to send some reinforcements. And that's kind of wonky my... Uh, my attack here. Come on, we can hold that. <sighs> Going to be close, but we got it. Okay, so now I think this, this level is pretty much ours. Let's just absolutely massacre. <laughs> it's pretty grim when you think about it. Okay, so as long as it doesn't make any counterattacks, we should be pretty good here. I mean, that is a strong, strong play. Yeah, there you go. That's how you play this game. I mean, another cool thing about this would be time trialing the levels. That's where I think some real mastery would come into play. Now, we've got noises in the ear from EDM1000, subscribe of Amazon Prime, and TrackDog448 for 12 months. That's a whole year right there saying 12 months of derpage. Always enjoying the streams. Thank you, my dude. Glad you enjoy them. Script Coded says, would you care to briefly explain the game? I think by watching it, you can figure it out. Oh, my goodness me. That's weird. Uh, I'm not sure what strategy to play here. I'm going to let you take that. Oh my goodness me. Then we're going to take it back. I, yeah, okay. I can kind of see where this is going. I think we just need to constantly reinforce or retake, so to speak. Yeah, so now you're going for that one, which means we've got to come back. And at some point we're going to, let's get some upgrades going. Right, we're just about hanging in here, you see. And there's a lot of noises going on in my ear. We'll check those out in just a second. Oh my goodness me, quickly now. Quickly now. We've got to keep on top of this. Uh, let's start upgrading these ones back here. Right. Get these going in. Yeah, I see what they're trying to do. Let's keep getting those upgrades. Oh my goodness me. We can't let them hold anything. I think maybe we should just do this. Alright, now. Let's, let's actually take them at the central one. Yeah, now we're going to take them over here. Uh huh, we're going to get this. Okay, they've got a one little counter attack, and then we're going to send everything to that. Done it. That's got to be it done. Okay. That was kind of easy, actually, that one. Mmm. Select everything and attack instantly, says Cosmonautical. Oh, yeah, we can select multiple buildings. I've already forgotten that. Okay, now it's introducing the tower element. So, the tower has a range and it attacks the units while they march. These are towers. They shoot the enemies that march past them. So, they will shoot us when they're not taken as well. And they shoot more often if you upgrade them. Okay, so obviously what we need to do is charge straight at that tower of everything we got. Okay, and then with the last of it we'll try and upgrade. Actually, we haven't got enough units now. Oh, that was really close. That was really, really close. So we're going to hang in and wait. If we look at the generation at the bottom, you can see the troops are kind of leveling out a little bit. Oh, they're upgrading their tower. Interesting. Well, we hang on. We're generating faster because they've only got a small building. So this is clearly like a tutorial-like level. So it should be pretty easy. I mean, technically, they've got probably no more than 12 troops in there. So we should be able to take it once we get a few marching across. Let's actually start moving them forward then. Puzzle Frex says, it was Ethos who I watched play this. My bad. Did Efo do videos on this or was it a live stream? Because uh, I've been subscribed to Efo a long time and I could imagine being pretty excited seeing someone you watch like pull open a, an old classic. Uh, hey X, does your veggie stock have a lot of sodium in it, says Tolbert Games. I don't know, but I should check that, shouldn't I? Anyway, I think we've got this. So we send them all out. And we take over that tower. 
beautiful and you know select all three let's just let's go whammy hopefully there ain't a counter attack and the first wave yeah they've just about cut it there cool very cool Nathan says hey what's up man hey Nathan Welcome to the stream. By the way, 440 peeps tuning in to, to check out a different game other than Minecraft. Thank you for taking the time to check it out. Be sure to hit the follow button if you want to see more of this game. Well, I don't know about that. <laughs> I just don't know about that. I'm going to take this tower straight away and then run the upgrades. Okay, so the tower's ours. And then we're going to upgrade it straight away as well. Actually, that's probably not too smart because they're not going to be coming near us anytime soon are they um, next thing we're gonna do though is go for that and then maybe sends hmm, a few extra troops here Oh, I didn't do that very well did I I kind of feel obliged now to finish off what I started that's re this is really bad when you miss time something like this look at what I've done to myself I know I should restart <laughs> I should restart this one that was very poor okay so Let's do that again. Definitely take this one and then not upgrade it, basically. Okay, so we got the tower. And now we want to take that. We pretty much need to flush out most of our troops from here and a few from over there. So we're going to start off with this. And then that. And we should definitely get it this time. Because it starts regenerating, so you need to time it so you actually take it over. That's very important. Now I think I'm going to flush some troops to that to back it up, beef it up, you know. And let's upgrade that. Let's get a good generation going on there at the front. Okay, we also need to pay attention to what the other team is doing. They're taking that a little bit behind us. We're going to play it a bit skimpy. We've not got a lot of troops to defend with, but we've got more generation going on. Okay, they're reinforcing the tower and they're struggling to take that. Um, me counter taking that right now would have been really good. Um, but it's not what we're going to do. But we are going to move more troops forward here. Yeah, now where are they going? To the tower? We should probably do this now. Yeah, look, they're coming out to defend. So this might not work the way I want it to, unfortunately. But we're going to sort of throw everything at this. Oh, I don't think it's going to work. Because they brought out absolutely everything. And you can't select units and pull them back after as well. I should have waited a little bit longer for that. Oh, not even close. Not even close. Right, we're going to upgrade all the ones at the back and focus on defense for a moment here. Have you played Mushroom Wars 2 with the multiplayer feature, says Leafo? I have not. Um, I heard bad things about about the uh, the second one, so I didn't buy it. By the way, Mon, PJC, gifting five subs. Thank you so much, dude. I was distracted by the game at the time, right? In between this level and the next, I'll be sure to read out. Um, all the messages and all that good stuff. I think we should uh, try and take this one here. I think that is the best strategy at this point in time for us. Not sure if I'm going to upgrade the tower though. Does the tower's range increase as well? Seems like that's the thing that's happening, right? I've got a feeling when we attack this, it's going to uh, rather heavily defend itself. Yeah, here we go. So I'm just sending out waves and waves of them. And we should take it over. And let's make sure we back up our tower behind it. Oh my goodness me, we didn't take it. Oh no. Wow, we've had two calamities so far, yet we're still sort of on top. And they've got more generation than us overall, I've just realised. So two wasted attacks and we're going to slip behind on generation. This might be a long one. Oh no, wait, actually I have upgraded all my stuff. What am I talking about? Right, I think we're going to try the same strategy again, basically. Seems to me the best way to go. We're going to throw a lot at this, right? We're pretty much throwing everything at it. Here they go. Keep going, troops. Keep going. Whittle them down. Oh, now they come out for the defense. It's like we're deadlocked. Oh my goodness me. I mean, their numbers must be low. Should I keep rolling the dice? they got to be low somewhere, right? I think I'm going to keep rolling the dice. We've got to hit them at some point. I'm pretty much 
investing absolutely everything I've got into taking this over right now. So I better keep sending my troops this way. Oh my goodness me. We're still on top. But we haven't been able to uh, get them all over here yet. Come on. Surely now. Surely now. They can't have much more than that. <laughs> uh, they've sent some of their troops to their tower. I reckon they're going to try a counter-attack here. Oh my goodness me. Come on. We're putting everything on it. And we can't take it. Maybe I've got an invalid strategy here. Yeah, they're slowly winning because of this. Oh man, what a deadlock. I've never had that kind of trouble before. Come on, everything, absolutely everything at it. They're just putting everything at it as well. They probably they probably got like nothing in any of the other buildings. Which gives me an idea actually. Okay, now we're going to go for that one. <laughs> By the way, it's burning. I think that's pretty much an indicator uh, that you could probably get it. Okay, did the distraction work? No, yes, just about. Okay, then all we've got to do is hold it, right? Hold, hold, hold. Hang in there. Oh, no, they're throwing everything at it now. They're throwing everything at it. We need to hold that. Hold the line. Hold the line, I say. Oh. <laughs> we got it. We got it back. It's literally just a war for that one thing. And we've got to hold the line. Okay, I think they're starting to build up a counterattack over here. Let's upgrade... We're going to hold the line here now. That's good. We're in front and we're going to keep it. We're going to keep in front. Right, I think I'm going to move these three forward to here. Okay, they're trying it. They're trying it. No, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> yeah, we're holding it and we're upgrading it at the same time. I think they're building up a large stockpile of troops over there though. That I am concerned about. Hi Priest Wulu says this is so intense. It might be intense, but we have the upper hand now. And uh, I think it's time for us to... Yeah, we're going to utilize that upper hand pretty quickly, I think. I think you will see. Because we're holding that. And now that we've held it, we're going to go take this. Move those there. Bring these down. And hopefully we're going to get two out of this. Oh, not quite. Okay, we're going to need some troops from there, I think. Oh, no, 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 no. No, we'll have none of that. We'll have none of that. Jeez. Oh, well, help. we're hanging in. We're hanging in. Oh, okay. Oh, so close. Oh, so close. Let's send it. Oh, jeez. Actually, we're going to need to send quite a few over there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, no. Send them back. Send them back. Okay, everything is on now. Everything is on. They've got so little, we just need to counter-attack, I think. Yeah, I need to move more of my troops about, don't I? Yeah, we got this, I think. Yeah, surely we got it now. Okay, I'm going to move some troops into the... Oh, yeah, here we go. Everything. Everything at them. Basically. Come on, you can join in. And you can go for that. Yeah, we got them. We got them. And the tides turn, right? The tides, they... Oh, jeez, no! No counter-attacking. Oh. Right, Mon, PJC, thank you ever so much for your gifted subs. If you hear your name being read out loud, you're now a subscriber. Thanks to Mon, PJC. Be sure to throw a love heart in chat. You can now do that because you have the subscription, the emotes. The love heart emotes. Uh, Fair994. CKA Y Y Y Y Y Brain one four three two Mini Manster and Natch Lamp PJE. Thank you again, Mon. I really appreciate that, dude. How's the clicker going? Let me know if you've been doing much on it or not, or if not, it doesn't matter. Um, check it out. We got a score. We got rewards. I don't know if this is like achievements or whatever, uh, but I think we're flying through the campaign here. So we've got to capture the marked building. Okay, now we're going to send everything onto that one building so that we can shuffle it along to the next one as quick as we can. 
Right, here you go. Going to shuffle everything along there and upgrade that one. So we're trying to play with like a minimal amount. Ooh, that's cause to restart actually. <laughs> let's let's really ace this, okay? So let's do that again. We're going to upgrade and then we're going to send everything over there. In fact, I'm going to rank the amount of troops we send along up. So we need more than 20 to head over there next, which we kind of don't quite have. Okay, so then we're going to send them. Absolutely everything is going over there, right? And even any extras we get. Yep, we got it. Sweet. Then we upgrade that one. So we've got free going and we've got not a lot of troops. And we've got to capture the thing in the middle. Now capturing the towers quickly would be very desirable. I am now going to capture this over here. With every little unit that's coming out of this building. And then hopefully upgrade it as well. Sweet. So we're just, I think, a little bit in front of them in terms of progressing and we're going to go for a couple of upgrades and then I think we've got to work on towers yeah if we just compare the slider over here we're uh, we're gonna we're gonna move in front of them pretty quickly but we need to take those towers before they do in fact what I'm gonna do is move some troops out of the range of this one so we move them through just one range to begin with so that might seem like a strange strategy um, but it might be one that works. Let's let's do this. Let's just send everything that way and get that tower going. It's going to be a close one. And now the other towers are firing on us. Are we going to get it? I think we are. I think we've got it. Come on, surely. Yes. Excellent. Let's upgrade. Send some troops over here and get this one upgraded as well. Get them all up to the next level. Okay. I think we're playing this really well. We've got a tower and we've got everything upgraded better than our opponent. Okay, we need... Oh no, we just upgraded that one. That's it. Sweet. Right. And we could try and upgrade our tower here. I think we need to take this one. And timing could have been maybe a little bit better there. Uh, I'm going to move some units across this way. Yeah, they've got a similar strategy here. We could try and tower hop. Let's try a tower hop. I just That's just a term. I just made it up, okay? I sound like a professional. I'm tower hopping, peeps. Look at me tower hop. Get on get on that tower hop, y'all. That might have been a very bad move. We didn't even take it. Ah, Let's upgrade our tower. And uh, move our troops forward again. So I guess actually taking, the, taking that one in the middle would have been the best strategy. Oh my god. Like, let's do that quickly. Right? Because then that's going to start generating troops for us. Yes! Oh, and that's all you had to do. So we could have won it a little bit quicker. If I'd have thought about that, you know, I'd never have sacrificed my units like that. Cool, so I guess I guess maybe the way you play gives you different rewards at the end. So let's go and quit to main menu now. Yeah, look, we've actually played a lot of the game so far. Isn't that pretty cool? You got this, says not the Dutch boy. I played it a lot in the past, so I kind of figured out some uh, good strategies, right? Oh, look, there is actually a timer, so you could potentially play like a speed run on this. Ah, capture buildings one by one as fast as you can. Capture buildings by attacking them with multiple troops simultaneously. Improve or convert most of your buildings. Fascinating. Right, this one's called Domination. Let's do it. Okay, we're going to... We've got to get two buildings, so I'm going to go for the one that's closer to it. Let's upgrade as well. We should definitely capture that. Yes, and then we're going to upgrade that as well. So now we should be generating at least a little bit faster than our opponent. Um, I think what I want to actually do with this one is try and take one of those immediately. So I don't have to worry about it later on. But I think upgrades make sense at the moment. Okay, so when those troops arrive, we're going to hop them over to the next one. And then send a few more troops there. So they're going for that. That makes sense. Uh, we could try a little bit of a interesting strategy here why don't we try and hop up to that one yeah so I'm not going to upgrade that uh, hmm let's do it let's just let's just give it a shot right that's got to be ours sweet and we're not going to upgrade it we're going to upgrade the one behind it move some units over here actually we will upgrade it because it's not currently generating anything um, so that was a very strong move to begin with. We're gonna get, we're gonna lose this thing pretty quickly if we're not careful, though. Um, and based on numbers at the bottom of my screen, I can't see why we wouldn't take this right now. 
Let's also upgrade that. Yep, this is this is good strategy right here. I think I think we got this, peeps. They could counter attack and take it back possibly, but we got it. That's surely going to be ours now. Surely, it's ours. That was a quick one, right? Very aggressive, aggressive behaviour. My dad ate all my peanuts, says Squirtle. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, capture all the enemy's buildings. Hey-ho. Uh, I guess straight away we're going to try and take that. I don't see much of another strategy. Maybe the upgrade was a poor decision there because... Are we going to get it? <sighs> Maybe it wasn't a bad decision. Right, we are kind of like against odds immediately here. I don't like this. This feels tough. Move, move some units across and we've got to obviously take the one, I think, at the bottom. But then we're going to get hit by the tower. So maybe taking the tower isn't such a bad idea. Okay, gonna upgrade ya. I think we're gonna have to upgrade this one here a lot. Yeah, look, it's got so many more units to work with. Right, so then that's killing loads. So I think now we're gonna attack this one. Mmm, now it's gonna hit us and hit us hard. Come on, we gotta take it. Yes! Okay, excellent. Upgrade immediately. Upgrade. I mean, oh, where are they going? They're going to that tower. Yeah, we've got to shuffle some troops across. Pretty. Yep, that, I could see that coming. I think we're going to lose that. Oh, we've got we to gotta take it back quick. Because it's keeping us in the game, right? Yep, uh-oh. Hang in there. Okay, the counter-attacking troops are arriving. Okay, this time I think we need to roll with an upgrade and bank on the idea that we might be holding on to this. Because we are generating more troops than they are at the moment. And if we could take that tower over there, that would be terrific. Okay, I think it's time to take that tower. And I think we've got enough units here to kind of defend ourselves. So, I'm going to send everything in. Come on, we only got to take five. And we've got it. Sweet. Okay, I'm going to upgrade that. I'm going to send some more troops across. And we are well and truly in the lead. And I'm not sure what the best strategy now is. Take their tower? We'd have to walk through it. Oh, no, actually, the best strategy is to reinforce this and take that. Because it's outside of the range of that tower. Okay, I think we're good to uh, annihilate. <laughs> Get annihilated. Send a couple more just in case. That surely got to do it though, right? Oh my word, that wasn't enough? How is that not enough? Oh, they get, they might get hurt, those units. Okay, just enough. Let's make sure we hold this thing. I think we're going to hold it. Yep, we got it. And possibly an upgrade. Right. I think it's pretty obvious who's won this one, right? Let's uh, Let's move our troops up here and move them across. A two-pronged attack is what we're looking for. Okay, so first of all, that lot go out. Then this lot. And we are surely going to take that tower. Yeah, it's ours. So's that. Oh, they're doing a counter-attack, though. We've got to reinforce something here. We've got to reinforce it big time. Yep, yeah, we're holding it. We've held it. That's it. We did it. Do you like that? Stino says, Woohoo! Stream on X's day off. It is my day off today. Well remembered. Well remembered. By the way, 540 peeps have tuned in. Be sure to hit the follow button here on Twitch if you're enjoying the stream. Ah, we got Tactician now. Uh, oh, cutscene time. Peeps are saying GG in chat. Thank you ever so much. X, what is your favourite vegetable? I really like cucumbers. I was having this discussion earlier, right? Peppers are technically, I think, um, fruit, because they're seeded. And I think cucumbers might technically be fruit, in the same way tomatoes are. Now, uh, we're going to run upgrades across the board, because we want to generate fast, fast, fast. And we only have three minutes, which suggests aggression. So, in the spirit of being aggressive, let's go for this one, and then reinforce it big time. Now, there's a good chance they might counter-attack over here, so we're going to reinforce that. And we didn't get it, which is very bad, so we need to send absolutely everything we got to it. 
in the hopes of just about capturing it. <laughs> and we did. Sweet. Okay, I think we got our troops nicely balanced out. We're going to make a couple of upgrades, move some units around. Yeah, and then we've got to hop along to the next one pretty quick. Um, that being said, we could do have an upgrade just back here. Let's upgrade. And then let's upgrade. And then we're ready for another hop, I think. Right, let's bring troops forwards. And I haven't decided where we're going to attack yet. They just upgraded there, then they reinforced. I think the better one to go for is this one down here. Okay, and then you're not generating, so we might as well send some troops. And uh, this is it. Let's die on this hill. <laughs> Here we go. We're all in. We're all in on this one. And we've got to capture it pretty quick. I Surely we've got that. Look at how many troops are heading in. It's just a case of how fast, really. At what point are we going to take it over? That's the point at which we take it over. So now what we do is immediately go for that one. And when the time is right, which is about now, we'll send in that lot. And now we just got to keep moving them forward, really. And it's all ours. This is all ours, surely. Okay, now we're going to go for that one. Because they ain't got enough units. And then we're going to go for that one as well. Yep. Easy peasy, my friends. I've played this game a lot in the past. I know when to be aggressive. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Why is it so interesting to watch you play literally any game that exists, said Hello Mayat. Well, I believe it might just be the way in which I commentate about what I'm doing. Uh, I've noticed some people like to hear the thought process, and I tend to talk the thought process out, and maybe I do it in a way that works for you. Uh, Phil467 is here for two months saying, I love your videos, keep up the good work. Thank you, my man, I appreciate your support, and I'm glad you enjoy the videos. I'll get back to doing them soon, I'm sure. What is your favourite fruit, says Toastmaster? Probably kiwi and watermelon are my favourites. Okay, uh, I, I feel like what high morale improves the attacking and defending of your army. Oh, I remember this bit. Yeah, I remember. Morale increases when you successfully defend and attack. Yeah, and upgrade your buildings. Sometimes it's better to stay defending when your enemy morale is higher than yours. Right, so the enemy morale is very low at the moment. Got it. Okay, so let's see if it doesn't attack us on these two. Because it looks like it's going to send everything to the middle, which is sort of the point it was making. So we want to generate a little faster and build up our morale. So now we're going to defend a little better than them. Is the Oh, here we go. Here we go. Hang on a minute. So we really need to hold that for a second, which we've done. Yep, and I'm going to let it be. That attack is going to fail. And now they're going to go for this one. So we're going to hop back over there and upgrade that. So it's just, oh, might be a little bit too close there. Okay, and I don't want to upgrade that. I think I'm going to have to hang on a little bit here. <sighs> Got to balance correctly, but if you look at my, my morale, it is doing good. Okay, uh, then we're going to send you there and these over here. Because I'm not sure quite where it's trying to attack us. Just need to hold on, really. I think we can upgrade and hold on there. Right, so morale is really good. We're going to be very good defensively at the moment. When we attack, though, we need to do it right. We need to have a good old counter-attack. I'm going to send a small amount of troops over here. So we can upgrade that one. Oh, no, it's fully upgraded. What am I talking about? Right, well, do we go over counter-attack while morale is high? I don't know if the morale is going to shift at all. My guess is if we're going to do it, we should take that one there. Um, which it is reinforcing currently. Okay, let's give it a shot. Yeah, I thought you might try something like that. Oh, hang on a second. I've left this one here exposed. Where are you all going? You're all going that way. And we got that. Brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. That worked really well. Okay, um, let's upgrade up here. Where are those troops going? To this one? I'm going to back it up, of course. And now I think you're weak over here. And then I need to send some of those to that one. Nice. I think we're getting the hang of this. Okay, they're trying to reinforce that. Let's move some of our troops around a little bit. Upgrade that. And our morale is still real good. I think we've got this one. Okay, so we need to back up that by the looks of it. Actually, they're going for that one. 
Whoo! That one will be weak. That's why they're sending them all the way across. Okay, but they just counterattacked, and they didn't survive. Sweet. Uh, we need to send a few troops there, and I think we've really got this now. Okay, where are those going? This one here. Kind of looks like they're sending them all towards that. Let's counterattack. And then bring some troops out from the back. And then we're going to upgrade this. Cool. Um, it makes sense to do that, I think, at this point in time. Got this. <laughs> we got this. It's ours. It's ours. BG Monster Fan says the game with this sound is so adorable. It's cool, isn't it? It's got a cutesy sound of design. Uh, Nustad says I am the third mushroom on the left. Oh, for real? <laughs> third mushroom on the left. You got taken. All right, here we go. Capture all the enemy's buildings. Um, look at this. Upgrade everything to begin with. Yeah, they want the tower first. Uh, let's go in there right after they bring the numbers down. And now it'll be our tower. See what I did there? Then let's upgrade some of these ones at the back here. In fact, I think, yeah, we'll keep it like that for a moment. Let's move some of these into the tower. And then upgrade the ones on the edges. I don't know where I'm going to send most of my troops at the moment, you see. Surely we should be in the lead. Like, I feel like we had a much stronger start than they did. And we got better generation of troops. We got the better morale as well. Apparently doing this increases morale. Oh, that's probably where it all went, into those upgrades. That's why we've got less numbers. Okay, so I'm going to take a small amount of those and shuffle them out of there, which might make that look vulnerable. But I want to keep this front here nice and strong. And I think now we're just going to be sending a lot of these troops over here. We've got fully upgraded everything. Um, maybe let's upgrade that. Morale is still good. We're almost at the next level morale as well. So let's do that again. And that hasn't quite given us the next level. But if they make a move, we're going to take them. Question is, should we make a move? Should we attack somewhere here? Oh, let's upgrade again. Now we've got three points of morale. We are really going to... We're going to whoop them <laughs> when we attack. That's for sure. Okay. Let's get those five down here. Because we've got an absolute army at the front. The whole of chat is the troops and actually X is our commander. Well, we've got 550 peeps and I've got about 500 troops. So y'all can consider yourself under my command, okay? I'll treat you good, don't worry. But as you can see, we've built an absolute base of attack right here. And uh, I think we're just going to go for it. Let's see how we fare. They're coming out to defend, so we really got to go for it. Morale has shifted all the way over to their side, though, which suggests that maybe I should have perhaps waited more. Um, but surely... Sh oh, no, I think they've got this because they've got the morale switch. Huh, that's interesting how the morale could turn around so much. Yeah, yeah, okay, they totally... Yeah, so the morale did not work in our favour. It is not a good idea to attack first which makes this level seem a little bit harder now okay so just like we did last time upgrade everything and then take the tower because we believe that they are going to try and do the same thing and then we will get the tower nice and easy after they've picked it off a bit okay we probably went in a little too early then but that's fine absolutely fine and getting some sort of achievement down here okay so if we ju i think we just keep rolling the dice with these upgrades I'm not going to upgrade the tower in the middle just yet, though. Is it a multiplayer game, says Electric Inferno? It is, um, it is. The second one is, I believe. And so is this one, but I think it might be defunct now. Okay, I'm going to upgrade all of these immediately, because I don't think the enemy is going to attack anywhere. It is moving some troops up to that point, which is a little bit alarming. Let's give that one some backup, and this one down here some backup. But everything is on the top level of upgrading, so although I've got less troops, now what we've got to do is encourage the enemy to attack us. So we might play the waiting game, or might try the early strike. What do you think, peeps? Let's try early strike this time. Everything's upgraded, let's try an early strike. While we've got that high morale, and there isn't crazy amounts of troops out there yet.
Right, let's see how that fares. We've got to take it. We've got it! Oh my goodness me, look at how much they're chucking though into defending it. I think, I think we're going to hang in. I think we're just about going to hang in on that one. And that gives us the morale that we're looking for. Sweet. Okay, let's send some of them back to the tower and upgrade that. And that's got to be it. That's got to be like a shining move right there. Let's keep moving units forward. Because we're going to generate so much more. we just got to make sure our next strike works the same way as that one. And it felt like getting a lot of them piled in at once was the way that it works. So let's look at the back row and send them in. Then as the next row comes along, we send them in. Then we're going to send this. And then the powerhouse. <laughs> Eat that! Absolutely. Absolutely. Beast mode right there. That was beastly. We got it. We got the hang of this. Bugman CX resubscribing for 40 months in a row. Thank you ever so much, dude. Appreciate your support. Hope you're enjoying the stream. Something a little bit different today. Wouldn't you say? Let's get a, a bunch of troops down here and where are they going? Where are you going? You're trying something and I don't like it. Okay, not on my watch. We're winning that battle and we're taking all the morale. And I think now the counter-attack is on. Let's reinforce that. Let's, uh, let's try attacking two at once, which is probably not actually a great strategy, really. Okay, but we've got so many coming from over there. We're surely going to pinch this victory and get an upgrade. And just about hold on to this one by the looks of it. Okay, let's move those over here. Yep, let's get an upgrade going on there. Shuffle some of you about. I think we got this, peeps. I think we got this. Where are they sending them all to? Well, we'll, uh, we'll attack that one then. If that's the name of the game. Sweet. I think it's time we just uh, wrap this one up, you know. Let's get this done. They ain't got enough troops to survive. Did you like that? <laughs> Was that good? Oh, look, they're doing a little counterattack. How cute. How cute. It almost works as well. It almost works. Wow, what texture pack is this, says Pumera. Isn't that the name of a song on the new tool record? Or something similar. How long have you been streaming, says Bird? It should tell you on the screen. 47 minutes, apparently. Hey, we've got the Architect. So I think the only one we haven't got is Expansionist. Okay, capture all the enemy's buildings. We are in the middle and we are surrounded. Upgrades immediately on all fronts except the towers. They're trying to take the tower. We will reinforce the tower. When you try and take the tower, we reinforce it. And then we're going to upgrade it as well. Because I think these things are going to be pretty vital to our survival. Uh, yeah, we're going to see something else happen in a second. Now, I think we need a counterattack going on pretty quick. However, if we defend ourselves well, we're going to get our morale up. So it might be a good idea to wait. They actually have a ton of units here. So I think upgrading these towers is a massive priority. It also kind of looks like they're upgraded to the max now. Okay, so I'm going to move the amount of units I actually have uh, down a little bit. And I want to make some of those a bit more mobile. Right, and I, yeah, maybe a waiting game is a good thing. I'm not sure. What do you think, peeps? Because if we can take one of those towers now, that's great. Sorry, one of their generating bits. But we've got to balance the morale, right? We've got to get the morale done right. If we attack one side, they're probably going to come from the other. And at the moment, we're sort of waiting for them to attack, which I don't think they're doing. Don't wait, says when did he go. It has seen, aggression seems to be good in this game, doesn't it? Now they're shuffling their troops around. I'm going to uh, shuffle some up here, I think. Okay, maybe a little bit more than that. So they know I'm up to something, but they don't know what. And now they're reinforcing on this side. Okay, and now that they've moved out of there, it's time for a counterattack. Uh, I think they're going for that. So let's try and reinforce it. Oh my good, they're, re they're really going for that. Uh, we need more of those up there. And we really need to hold on to that. My word, do we need to hold on to that? Yes. Brilliant. Okay. We managed to defend. Now what we need to do is probably even out the amount of troops. Um, that was a bit on the risky side. Send a couple back there. Upgrade you again. And we're going to go for this top one now. And hopefully we can, uh, we can do all right. It's a real roll of the dice here. In you go. Go in with them. Come on. Yeah, we got two now. Brilliant. Okay, let's get a few of you back over there. Right, we did it. Uh, let's move some of these troops about because these are kind of full up, right? 
nicely done upgrade that again and uh, yeah they've still got a lot of troops we got some troops now wait for a counter-attack says Netherax I feel like waiting for a counter-attack at this point is kind of good um, we just got to know like we know that one up there is weak so if they attack from here we're gonna be heading up to the top area um, let's get okay what are you going for the tower in the middle okay it's kind of not ideal Kind of not ideal. I think we just need to hold this and see where they go. Because they're shuffling them out of there still. Okay, we're holding the middle tower. Okay, and now we're going to go with the counter attack. And I'm going to send some troops from these places as well. In fact, a few more from up there. Move some of those about. And we've got it. We've got one up there as well now. Excellent. Excellent stuff. Right. Uh, where are they going to go? What are they going to do? These are questions we need to know the answers to. We're keeping our morale up, that's good. I can't help but feel we should go for this one here now. I'm going to send uh, half, half, and free. And we should have that in a moment. Okay, and I want to send some of these troops over here to the very middle of the map. <sighs> Didn't quite get it. I think we need to just finish that off and then use these troops. Yep, they're going to try and take the tower. Nope, they're going for something else. They are going for something else. We must defend it, and we must take that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We the, the axes might have shifted here. Oh, I think we've lost all the morale. Yeah, we lost all of the morale, so now we're stuffed. Oh! Oh, it turns like that. We were so close to taking this. Yeah, it turns like that, peeps. Uh, we're going to have to restart this one. Because we lost our morale. Jeez. Okay. Okay. Lesson learned. People say keep going. Now, I, I know how this works. When you're fighting back, it can be so difficult. Uh, I did a whoopsie there. I upgraded everything too quick. That has got to be enough, surely, to defend it. Oh, look. We've got loads in the middle there. What am I on about? Okay, so that gets our morale up to two levels. Everything's fully upgraded. And we're generating troops. Hey, Asuma, I used to watch all of your YouTube videos. Just wanted to tell you how much I always enjoyed your content, said LC. Damned. Good to know, man. Glad you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoy the stream today as well. Fair says it should have taken the left side when you started because the right couldn't reinforce. Yeah, yeah. Once you start tipping one side, it's probably best to go the whole way with it, right? Okay, well, we're seeing it move troops out of the top area. Um, I can't remember. I think we took the first move, right? Was the idea. We made the first move over here. I'm actually going to get most of those troops to go up top, I think. So we'll try and make the first move again. Although we've lost some morale. We did have two stars for a moment there. Hmm, does make me wonder. We might have gotten a little bit on the lucky on the lucky side. And now they're reinforcing the one that I want to take. Uh, maybe, okay, what are you doing there? Now they're moving some out and they're coming into my area. Okay, where are you going to? Bottom corner, we can defend that. We can absolutely defend that. And again, more troops down there. This will boost our morale big time. And I need to move some of you back out in a moment. Okay, now move out about half and we're going to go for that. I hope this works because we've got two morale stars. Yeah, it's on fire. I think we've just about got that. We got it. Sweet. So we want to kind of counter into that pretty quickly while we've still got those two stars. Let's get some of those troops up here. Let's send all of those right over here and then time it correctly. Timing is important. While we've got the morale boost, we then go in like that. Oof. Nice. Upgrades all around up here. Sweet. Okay. Um, let's reinforce our towers. This is all very evenly spread, the numbers here at the moment, which is good. So, mistake we made last time was to attack the right. We need to get the left. And we'll wait for full upgrades. Hey, assuming this looks like a fun game, says Fay of Doom. I'd say it's fun. I think they're planning an attack on the right. Yep, here it comes. And they're going for the tower in the middle, so we reinforce it. Maybe even some troops from up there. And reinforce it once more, although we've clearly got this. And then I think we attack over here, right? And maybe move some behind back there. And maybe move some across from here. Ah, look, we're very close to winning. Surely we've got it. Nice. 
Nice. That could have been a bit swifter, but uh, it wasn't. Let's move some of you out and around so we can keep generating. Oh, I think I've got it set way too high. They might counterattack. Let's drop some back there. Okay, and then I think I'm going to reinforce that tower and this tower. And while our morale is high, let's get these lot going in. Then that lot. Surely that's a victory. I see fire. That's good. Sweet. Nice. Even an upgrade available. Well, I think you can see where the battle is going now, right? Keep pushing the attacks, Zarkas. Yeah, we just want to time the attacks well. Um, let's keep putting troops into these towers. I like doing that. Just got to time it well, is all. Let's see where these lot go. Oh, they're going for that one. They're going for that one. And uh, we're not going to let them win. Yep, get some more in there to defend. So a counter-attack would be really good at this point. We've also got this going on over here. Let's counter-attack with all of those. Because we're surely going to win this down the bottom. We got it. So now I think we just need to send most of these troops over to this spot. Hmm... Let's send everything to it. I want to be super aggressive. Yeah, now they're sending it right. So we might lose the morale battle here. We need to see some fire on that building and see it pretty quick. I don't think we're going to see it. In fact, they're trying the old counter-attack. So we need to do... Oh, which one are you going for? They're going for that one. Okay, I really kind of messed up there. I was too aggressive. But luckily, we managed to hang in. Okay. So morale is two to three at the moment. Two to three. Got to keep that momentum, says Track Dog. Yeah, I kind of spoiled it a bit by um, overdoing it there. But we have got a ridiculous amount of troops. we just got to time our battle. So what are they going for there? Oh, oh, okay. Whoopsie. How did I take so many out? That was an accident. Oh, my word. That was silly. I just took too many out without realising it. Right, that means morale's 3 to 1 now, so we really need to make the next move count. And uh, we've got to maybe wait for them to make a move. Seems a bit ridiculous with the amount of troops we got. So where are they going? They're going for that one again. Right, and that means these two bits here are weak at the moment. So let's send everything to that one to begin with. And then these ones are going to get joined in as well. Okay, now you're going to attack that while they've made it weak. And that one's going to attack that one. And then we're going to take this building. Sweet. Let's upgrade. Eh, not quite. And you know what? I've ran a lot of troops out of my tower. Right, their morale is rather high. I think I kind of overplayed it again then. Come on, surely we got this. Uh, I think we're playing them a victory here. Alright, hold the line. Jeez, I've got so many noises in me here. Okay, let's uh, let's let's regroup here. That was pretty poor and we've almost lost this. So, time to regroup. Strengthen the towers. As that did not work. Bam! We got gifted subs from Nathan. Thank you, dude. I'll be reading that out in just a moment. Going to uh, pay attention to what's going on here, as you can understand. Got to win this level, right? I, sh I should have had that, but I gave them the morale boost because I didn't time my attacks right. I thought we had them. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy there. Easy there, Tiger. Okay, what are they attacking? Because we need them to lose an attack, really. Yeah, okay, we can defend. Ooh, close. Then they go. No, they're going for that one. Come on, everything back over here. Okay, where are they going? This one now? I think they're actually still going for that one. Crazy. But that's how it goes. Right, now we've got the morale boost. We're taking that. We're taking it. It's ours. No questions asked. Come on, that's surely ours. Sweet. And we can probably upgrade it as well. But let's get the troops in there. Right, they're actually moving them down to this bit, I've noticed. And let's get all the ones that aren't generating anything, sending them over to one spot for now. Uh, we kind of need some reinforcements here, dude. <sighs> Almost lost it, but we didn't. Okay, now let's attack that one. This is it. This has got to be the tipping point here. Yeah, this is it. Come on. Let's just, let's just end this now. Alright, it's over. 
It's surely over. Yeah, sweet. That took us a little longer than uh, than we might have hoped. Nathan, 197, thank you ever so much for gifting those subs, dude. Appreciate you supporting the community here. If you hear your name being read out loud, you've now been gifted a sub by Nathan. We've got Blackjack69666, Engagefiber78, Holla underscore Holla, Niraro8, and Octopus. Congratulations, and, and Nathan, thank you again. Appreciate it. According to the Art of War by Su, uh, Sun Tzu, always outnumber your opponent by as much as possible. That book is fantastic, by the way. Um, yeah, like, I mean, war is a disgusting thing, right? But in terms of the tactics and whatnot, there's a, there's a lot to be learned in that. Um, your soldiers attack and defend better if you control forges. Yeah. So we make our units stronger by controlling those, essentially. So we'll take the one that costs 10. And we're actually going to move like everything over so we can hop to the next island is the idea. They're also... We could have like done a counter attack. Oh, I really like the idea of cheeking them out on that. Hang on. Let's see what they do again, right? Okay, so I can send like a fraction of my units to take over that. Let's do that. Then when they attack, if they go for it, we'll be able to take it. Yeah, okay, so now we're stronger. Now we go in with a very generous helping of troops. They're going to arrive just before us. I was hoping actually I'd time that a little better. Because we're oh, just about going to hold on there. I uh, needed to have reinforced it. So if I'd have waited a tiny bit longer. Or not. Okay, I think I need to reinforce it again. Because <laughs> they, they are coming for us. Here's another problem. It's alright doing this. I mean, we do have the morale boost. But look at how many troops we're generating yeah okay I think I want to try that strategy one more time right so we first of all take this one with a fraction of troops okay and then we're gonna send a majority but we've got to time it a little bit better because I then need to take over something else okay so send them about now I th oh again a bit close they're gonna get there lose a few troops then we're gonna jump in and take it from them and then we get the morale boost and now we just need to keep supplying this with more troops. And then we're going to win these battles. But we're also not going to be generating any more troops. Which is interesting. So keep reinforcing. For now. Maximum reinforcements. Yeah, I'm not so sure that was a good strategy. Because they're already taking down the numbers of some of these. And I haven't got the numbers to take over everything else yet. Hmm. We need that there. Or maybe we need the one that they're... Like, what if we bunny hopped our way forward and took that one next? Yeah, let's try it. Oh, no, they're going to get there just before us. Come on, let's take it back. Let's take it back. It's ours. It's ours, peeps. Cheeky strategies from X. We've got to keep this supplied now. We've got to think of it like a supply route. We've got to keep the units coming up here to defend. And we also want them to generate faster, so we'll sacrifice five for that. Um, they're now, oh, maybe could have counterattacked for that one. Let's keep it going. Let's keep this supply route up. If we look at the balance of troops, we're almost on it. Mm, we're going to have to take, we're going to have to try and counter-take the next one it goes for, whatever one it chooses to do. And, oh, that's probably a little bit cheeky, running the numbers low. Okay, let's shuffle you along. And again, keep on shuffling them up. Looks like they're working on upgrading the buildings. Maybe uh, put an extra unit over here as well from time to time. Okay. This is now not going to generate any more troops is another point to make. So I'm going to send some back. And that means we might be wise to take over something else here. Right. Are they attacking? Oh my god. I think they're attacking it. No. They're going for something different. What are they going for? That one. Right. We're going to follow in directly behind them. Okay. We're going to counter take it. Oh, we're a little bit slow. We're a little bit slow. Can we get it? We got it. That was cheeky, my friends. This is some cheeky strategy we're running right here, and I like it. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Yes. Uh, let's also upgrade and send a small amount of you over there. That was really well played. Okay, we're going to keep moving things up the supply line. This one's going to send some more units over there. I like it. Let's reinforce that a little bit more. Okay, they're going for the one down the bottom. Let's upgrade the one at the top. Let's, uh, right now, get in behind them. I want lots of troops going there. Yeah, I had a feeling you might try that. I had a feeling. Okay, got to defend, reinforce. I think we're going to hang in. 
We're hanging in, peeps. We did it. Whew. Okay, let's move some troops up there. Upgrade the one at the top. Upgrade the one at the bottom. We are playing this in the cheekiest style. I tell you, the cheekiest of styles. I'm liking it. Right, let's uh, move some more troops up. Yeah, we're kind of balanced across the front. I think we might be wise to try and take one of these ourselves very soon. Um, the enemy has done the hard work for us, hasn't it? It has done the hard work for us. We have made very good use of these upgrades and morale, that's for sure. Because we still have not as many units as our opponent. Okay, I'm going to send some troops in from the back here. And then a fractional amount from that side and this side so they can stay defended. And then maybe a little bit more. Oof, that was close. Upgrade immediately. I think we got this, my friends. I think we got this. Let's just uh, reinforce the front line. That being said, that's kind of full. Let's get a few more units in these buildings just in case something happens. And the level is ours. We're just going to, uh, you know, be careful. Be careful is what we're going to do. Right, let's reinforce those again. And uh, now we need to move troops off the front line because they're well defended. And what move are they making? They're reinforcing that one. Right. And they're going for this. And we can defend nice and easy. Because we've got the troops available. Whew, they got a lot of units. They just moved over there and they lost. Right. I think what we're going to do is send a large amount of troops from there. A small amount of troops from this side and a medium from there. So timing wasn't too great. But look, we, we took it. Okay. And now we've got all the units we need to make upgrades. Sweet. Right, let's reinforce these two again because they are important. Let's move some units off of this one so it can generate. That one as well needs to generate. Upgrade over here at the back. Maybe give that a few more troops to upgrade with. And uh, now, as you can see, it's pretty much our turn to take something of theirs. we just got to get the timing absolutely right, I think. So let's move units forward. These two are going to be first in line, I think. Okay, we're going to go for a big attack there. And then this one's going to reinforce it. And then we're going to leave these ones here in reserve for the counter-attack, which they're trying. And they didn't double up on the counter-attack. Let's upgrade. We've got so many troops. Let's send a little amount this way as well. Keep that reinforcement going. Okay, now I know that that one down here is weak, but let's get the troops over here first, is what I'm thinking. Okay, we're going to move half of those and half of these. And then another half of those. That one should definitely be ours now. Okay, let's move some troops up and about. Sweet, I think we got this. Uh, looking at the numbers, I think we can just do this straight away. All right, it doesn't have to be difficult. Let's get some troops heading over there already. Upgrade that, and uh, I think we did it. I think we did it. Yep, I reckon we did it good. Nice. This is pro-level Mushroom Wars, says the Aftershock. Maybe it is, maybe it's not. Hey, I don't think we got Inspirer before. That's cool. Let's go to the uh, main menu. How far along are we with this? Level 15. Wow. That's cool. I think we'll do another stream of this soon. Tomorrow I won't be streaming, by the way. But like, I feel like we're halfway through it, so we could probably do two streams on this game, right? But that was cool. And the later levels get harder, so... They'll probably take a little longer. And then there's some skirmishes we can always do as well. Right, we've got to take the buildings that are marked. Uh, we're going to take these as quick as we can. We might get attacked, which is a little bit worrisome. Okay, and then we're immediately going to go up there. And I'm going to send some troops back. And then we're going to do that. So that's our strategy for today, right? Try and take everything super quick. Go for upgrades. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't like that. I don't like that. Oh, God. They got a forge. We have to use morale to defend. Ah, okay. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. Um, but we have to play fast here. Also, Drunk Cow in chat. Welcome to the welcome to the stream. Uh, Gorilla Jumpsuit. Resubscribe of Amazon Prime. Thank you so much, dude. Appreciate your, well, your resubscriptions and all of that. Thank you. Uh, let's go take that one and this one. And then we do want to try and take that one again. I think we're going to have to just roll everything up there. Let's get the upgrade going. Uh, then let's hop you back. Upgrade and hope they don't change their mind. Upgrade again. Ooh, is that enough? Kind of looks like it's not. Oh, that was, that was just a bit of suicide right there. 
Ah, that's the problem. Oh man, that's a real problem. They're just going to go for that super quick. Okay, let's try this again one more time. So, smallest amount that way and then three quarters this way. In fact, we're just going to have to keep reinforcing that to begin with while we generate. Okay, have we got this one here? Yeah. By the way, I see derp faces in chat. You're insulting me. Okay, this is not derping. This is figuring out the strategy. You know, you don't just waltz into a level and ace it. You've got to figure out what you're doing first of all. And that's what I'm trying to do right now. Um, sending units from this building here gets them killed. So we have to send them from back here. And now we're kind of praying. We're going to pray in that that is just about enough. I think we're going to win on morale. Oh, so close. So close. Let's try it one more time. And then maybe diverge. Or diverge? Diverse. Diverse? I don't know what I'm saying. Figure out a different strategy is basically what I was trying to say. Right. So now what we have to do is send them from back here next time. Okay. Uh, just keep sending, sending, sending. And upgrade that. Cool. Yeah, so we've got to keep sending them from the very back, which incentivizes us to take that one, even though it costs a lot. Uh, are we going to do it? Are we going to do it? <sighs> are we going to do it? I don't think so. No. Peeps, I really feel like that's the right strategy. Counterattack them, says Util Cypher. Now, you've got to look at the way the map is poised in the beginning, right? We have so less generation than them. That we have to come up with a different strategy, basically. Maybe we should just do that from here. So I could send... Yeah, no, that's the way you do it. That's the way you do it. Okay, I think I've got it. I think I've got it. Yeah, it makes so much sense now. I need to send smallest and smallest. And then the most, like everything up here. Because we're going to take those two. And we've done it with adequate numbers. We can get an upgrade going. Whoopsie, that was a big mistake, but... In theory, we just sent a few extra troops that way, so maybe not. And now it's the question of are they going to continue to go for it. I think I'm even going to reinforce it with that. A little bit of sacrifice going on. <sighs> Come on, hang in there. Hang in there. No, not even with that. Not even with that. Assumer is basically saying improved, adapt, overcome. Yeah, essentially. However, our strategy isn't quite paying off. I don't know if we should try and hang in and play the morale game by defending. But if we could start with that really strong position, it just seems so much better. So uh, we'll give it a shot again, right? We're going to go one, two, and then buckle my shoe. Everything goes up there. Maybe I just need to be a bit aggressive. Let's not upgrade. Let's send everything with it and upgrade this one. In fact, keep sending troops. Okay, we've upgraded that. Yeah, no upgrades up there, though. We're just literally walking every little troop that comes out of here up there to defend. And if that don't work, then I ain't got too much of an idea what will. It looks better in terms of numbers. Oh, no. I don't think we got it. I don't think we got it. Why don't you capture the 60 straight away, says Mr. Olgama. Because then you're generating nothing to defend with the other ones, right? Okay, we're going to have to try and play a defensive strategy then. So, uh, let's... Oh, I see what you're saying. Like, would it be worth going for that one first? Probably. Maybe these two as well. Okay, let's see what happens. Because we could bounce back to this spot over here. So, that cannot be captured straight away. That is worrisome. Let's uh, not do that then. Okay, so we're going to take this and that. And then we're potentially just going to wait. I think if we're not going up top, we need to upgrade these quickly. So, we get straight on the upgrades. Ah, this one... Is that an upgrade? Yeah. So maybe I could have sent those troops about a little bit quicker. If we want to get more upgrades going, then we need to get them out there. So they're going to basically take that, and that's theirs. That is theirs. Upgrade, upgrade. So now we're generating as fast as we can. We may try and counterattack for that one if they go for it. I think that'll be our best strategy. So putting troops here is a good idea, I think. Yeah, that is going to be our strategy then. The old counter-attack, if we can. But we need to keep those troops generating, that's the thing. Right, maybe we could try and just take it now. Like, maybe not go for the counter-attack. They went for an upgrade over here. Okay, off you go. 
They're going to counter-attack us if they're smart. And then we send in the second lot. And look at the way they collide together. That has got to take it. So close. So close. Let's reinforce because it's close to a neighbor. And we also want to uh, upgrade it. Cool. Right then, that's that's a firm start. We want to take this over here, but we got to we got to come up with some sort of counterattack strategy, or some way to get our morale up at the moment. Okay, let's move some of you out of there. We're gonna have to shuffle these troops around so they keep generating. Which is kind of weird. Cause look, we're gonna run out of capacity basically. Oh 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 oh, and those ones are gonna get shot. Uh oh. Right, this is where defending is going to be our best asset because it's going to increase our morale. And we have successfully defended. So much so we're going to send a couple of troops back. And from that one as well so it can keep generating. Right, and they just did an upgrade up the top there. We've got one morale, they've got nothing, but they've also got the forge, which we definitely want to take. And maybe taking that tower in the middle could be great for us because so much traffic is going to have to move through there when playing. So that's something to consider. Okay, so we're going to have to shuffle troops about. So they're just going to walk from one place to another so we can keep generating them. And they're going to try it again by the looks of it. Let's uh, let's get on reinforcing there. Also, need to reinforce that then. Okay, just moving troops about. Alright, they're going for it. We're going to have to counter-attack that. I really think we best strategy is counter- Right, in you go. In you go. We want to take that. That's got to be ours. This is it. We're gambling. It's all or nothing. We got it. Come on. We've got that. Yes. Sweet. Uh, I'm going to upgrade that immediately because we want the better range and we want to be... Okay, where are you going for? This one? Now we don't have to worry about them picking off our troops. We're in a strong position, my friends. Strong. We are a little short on numbers compared to where I'd like to be. Um... Actually, you kind of don't need reinforcing. That does, though. Sweet. Uh, I might even try and reinforce the tower in the middle a little bit more. Bit by bit. Keep our troops there. Keep them uh, optimal for moving around. Okay. Take the forge next. Hmm. I don't know how many units they got in the forge. I, 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 It's a tough call. I feel like we need to keep our morale very high. So we need the counterattack going on. So I'm kind of waiting for them to make a move, right? And they're making a move. That's good. That's actually really good for us because they're just giving us some more morale. And that's very easy to defend. Very easy. Might even send you a few more. Okay. Um, hmm. Oddly, we both lost morale then. Despite winning. Yeah. They, they're generating more troops than us. I'm not sure if I should take try and take their base or something. Uh, but they're trying it again. I can't help but feel I don't even need to reinforce it, but we'll shuffle a couple back. Why are they doing that? That's a bit of a null strategy. Because they're just going to give us more morale, right? Wait for attack, then strike the forge, says Neverax. The forge really might be the way to go. It's hard to say. I'd love to be able to save it at this point. Well, let's move some uh, troops around. In fact, let's move them into the center, really. Okay, so they're going for that again, and I hardly need to back it up. Very strange, but it's not giving us the morale. Yeah, even though we're winning, it's not giving us the morale. So some people want to see me take the upper right. I think, uh, I think it makes sense to go for that one. We just have to get the timing absolutely right. Let's, uh, let's give it a shot. It's about the best we can do. Okay, so I'm going to move... Mm, they're reinforcing their forge, and that means they've got a lot of troops to maneuver from the forge. Let's uh, move those over here for now. And they're slowly increasing on the uh, the cap of units. Hmm. They, they're basically going to take the tower in the middle if I take that, I reckon. So... <sighs> it's hard to say. It's hard to say. Okay, I think we're going to go for it. Yeah, we got this. Surely. Surely that's got it. It's on fire. Oh my word, how did that not get it? It was on fire and everything. 
Okay, reinforcements have arrived. Oh my goodness me, how did we not get that? That sucks. Oh my word, okay. Just about. Whoo! Okay, now we've got to pay attention here because we just about took that and we are very short on troops all over the place, really. Okay, we don't want them attacking this one. We don't want them attacking that one. Just about paid off. I think my uh, timing there wasn't so strong. Uh, but we have two morale, actually. Now, I know some of you want me to take the forge, but we know they've got a lot of units parked in the forge. So it's a bit of a waiting game. Let's get our numbers out in front of theirs. They are short on troops as well, says All Shall Neil. Well, really, it's about the comparison between the two, right? Uh, by the way, thank you for the cheers and bits, Nathan. I've just realised I'm 10 minutes behind on that. We're getting totally engrossed in this game here. Uh, I've got to move some units across. And let's move a fractional amount all the way to the middle. So they, they know the forge is their best game at the moment. That's why they're shoveling everything over there. And we're losing morale. I think it's slow. Yeah, it slowly ticks down, actually. That's why we weren't keeping it. Ah, finally. Well, we don't have the morale boost now. But we do have the numbers boost, which makes me think it's smarter to probably take this than that because it will be so well reinforced. Right, this might be a, a good way for us to gain some morale here. Looks like they're actually sending quite a lot that time. Let's hope that this, uh, this actually holds out. Okay, they have given us the morale boost. We have to take this now. We have to absolutely take this. And then maybe reinforce the tower after. It's on fire. It's got to be ours. It is ours. And they're coming out. And they have a bit of a morale boost, but that's it. Okay, let's get uh, some reinforcements up there, actually. Right, I think we got this. I think we got this. Numbers look good everywhere. And now we've got the forge. Uh, and we got two morale actually at the moment, so let's just try and make the inevitable happen now. Even a small amount from up there, I think, we can afford. That's got to be ours, come on. Yes, nice. Yeah, you can kind of see where this is going now, right? I think we've got this. I think, oh, hang on, that's a big roll of the... No, wait, they're not going for that one. Okay, let's upgrade it. They're going for the forge. Let's move everything out to defend it. And then we want to hit them with a counter-attack. Cool, they're coming out to defend. But they ain't getting anywhere with it. Uh, we kind of got them on all fronts here, I think, peeps. All fronts. Okay, let's move a bunch of units all the way over here. Send some units that way. Send some units that way. And, you know... Victory is ours, right? Victory is ours. Oh, wait! <laughs> the counter-attack. Oh, they didn't... In oh, they just about did it after we won. Amazing. Uh, Nathan197 is here with a cheers and the bits saying, This game looks cool. Looks fun. What is it called? Well, the title is on the screen. It should be, anyway. Uh, this is Mushroom Wars, my friend. Thank you so much for your cheers and bits. It's available on Steam and the PlayStation Network. Okay, capture all the enemy's buildings. Let's pause for a second. Uh, Professor Dr. Pug is here for 29 months. Professor Dr. Pug, thank you ever so much for your support. I appreciate it. We've got Cosmo Volley here, resubscribing for 11 months, saying almost a year. Yes, it is. Thank you so much, dude. We also got Simon C92 for 33 months. Thank you ever so much, Simon C. Appreciate it. Also, thanks for the GGs. In the uh, <laughs> titles on the screen, is it quit to menu? I meant on your physical screen, as in above the video. Jeez. Um, thank you so much for your support. Let's let's do this. Okay, we got a forge. We got one way of generating units. I'm going to upgrade that immediately, and then I'm going to send out to that one and to this one. I think we want to be fast here more than anything. We just need to get some generation going in front of this tower. We also need to leave units inside of the tower. Um, you know, you kind of you kind of don't want to go too far into their territory, right? But at the same time, they're kind of all over the place too. Right, well now we've got that one. Yeah, we're looking alright. Let's get some upgrades going and some reinforcements coming out here. So we're a little bit skimmed on the front, but we need to make... 
this not really an advantage count at the moment, which is to basically take one of these these towns they got going on. Okay, join in with them. Ah, I don't like the way they're uh, I don't like the way they're all piling in on that. That don't look good. That don't look good. I think we might have given them too much morale there. That did not work. Let's uh, let's restart. You know, I know some of you don't like it when I do this, but you learn and then you realize, oh, I should play these moves a little bit different, right? So what we need to do different, I think, is send those over here and then uh, like like that, basically. That should work, unless I've timed it poorly. No, that actually went really, really well. Then we get the upgrades in a little bit quicker. And look how spread out we are. That's much better. Uh, if anything, though, those can come over here. And then maybe we do a quick hop. Send some of those over as well. Come on. That's got to be close. That's ours. Yes. Nice and fast. Adaptive strategy there. Let's get some of these units out and about. Uh, they're going for that one. And they're going to lose, I tell you. It's going to be close, though. Or is it? No, we totally aced it. Sweet. Okay, upgrade that one, please. Upgrade that one. Move those over there. Upgrade this one. Move those over there. Noise. Noise. Pretty quickly, we need to take another attack here. Uh, I'm going to go for this one. Right. Forget about that upgrade. We need that. And we got it. Sweet. Okay, now we can take an upgrade. Let's move some of those forwards. Uh, this one back here actually doesn't have an upgrade yet. So we'll move a few troops back. Um, upgrades. And jostle one back over there again. Right, keep these ones at the back, moving it forward. We've got that one back there upgraded. And uh, you can see where this is going. We've still got this two stars of morale. Let's, let's start at the bottom and send them up. Okay, they know what we're on to. They know what we're doing. Uh, let's back up before they do a counterattack. That just about works, but we need to reinforce it quickly here. The morale is keeping us hanging in there, and that is beautiful. Okay, let's bring... Let's upgrade that, bring troops forward again. Bring those over here. They're trying it, but they're going to fail. We've got the morale on our side. Let's keep moving troops forwards. Yeah, keep moving them forwards. That's the name of the game. It's not. The, game. No, the name of the game is Mushroom Wars. Leave me alone. Okay, we're going to now roast them in the middle here. And then reinforce. Oh, it's just all going our way, isn't it? They haven't got a chance, basically. Uh, let's go for that one next and play them like that. Just keep hopping and taking them over, basically. Keep moving them from the back forwards. Beautiful. They're going to try something here, aren't they? And we're not going to... Oh, they might. They almost, but they're not going to. Okay, let's move some things forward again. We've got some weak spots and we've got some ridiculously strong spots as well. Which we will jump out from. Okay, keep moving them forwards. Move them down. That one's ours as well, right? Yeah, just too many victories. They do have a couple of morale stars, but... Oh, hang on a second. That's not what I wanted you to do. Let's also take over uh, this one while we're at it. They just don't have enough to fight back, basically. It's uh, pretty much ours, as you can see. Was that good? Was that fun, my friends? Did we just absolutely ace that level? Oh yeah. Al Shaq Neil says, Oh Lord! <laughs> Morale plus forge equals OP, says uh, THV, TH4, or what is that? Fav, Favs? I don't know what your name is. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go next level. You can change your building type. Press shift to open the upgrade menu. Oh wow, that's cool. Peeps, we're going to have to do a cliffhanger and leave that for the next stream, right? That sounds like a cool feature right there. I've totally forgotten about all of this stuff. Uh, can we do that? Yeah. So that's as far as we've got. There's another stream or two in this, possibly. And I think we might just try and complete it again, because it's been an absolute blast playing this. Real-time risk, says, when did he go? Good description, really. Good description of it right there. Um, there is undoubtedly no one else probably playing this game on Twitch right now, right? So... Uh, for our raid, as we do, uh, gonna send you over to Zuljin, my old buddy from um, from Hermitcraft, of course. 
And peeps, I will not be streaming tomorrow unless I do it in an obscure time of day, which is very unlikely. So I'm probably going to see you on the weekend. Um, but that's it from me this one. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to hit the uh, raid button in chat and I will see you all soon. Ciao for now. Bye bye.